Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Natalie here back with a message for you guys. I hope everyone is doing well. So let's tap into this uh, message and see what spirit has for the collective right now. Keep in mind, this is just a general message. So it may not resonate for you, okay? But time is fluid, energy can be reversed. Um, female can come out as male energy. Male energy can come out as female energy. Let's see what's going on with the message for the collective holy spirit and angels all right so we have skunk spirit know your worth and then we have the grasshopper spirit and then we have the snake spirit oh wow okay um you may need to get away from somebody before it's too late that's what i'm hearing yeah show your strength each day ground your energy and be peace life is a mystery have purpose Something about showing your strength. It's something something about, okay, yeah, um, it is strong to love others, right? But at the same time, showing people too much love does kind of, it, it is kind of a weakness, okay? And um, I feel like you definitely are in a situation where you have been giving your um, great spirit to someone that might not deserve it spirit said it's okay it's time to heal um take a leap of faith do something different act out on faith is what i'm hearing 144 on the clock let's see what is this this is eight of cups if your life feels stale explore some new scenery some of you guys just need to get out strength reverse hmm it's like you have venom in you. The snake put venom in you. So where like, even if you aren't around this person or you're not codependent on them, it's like you're, their venom in you um, is still affecting you. Eight of Swords, stop overthinking and just do it. There's something that you just need to just do already. <laughs> It's like there's something about your insecurities. I feel like it has a lot to do with the, the people around you or like someone raised you to like, like not see your worth and not take leaps of faith. And they bite you every now and then spiritually. They infect you. Yeah, seven of swords. Are your actions really as selfless as you think? Yeah, this person didn't care or these people don't care. Ace of Cups reverse. Do you feel that in your heart? That's potential, dear. It's in the reverse. Someone doesn't feel like they have potential. So is that you? It could be a masculine. Always compose yourself before giving a response. Someone could be like emotionally um, overreacting. Or like this could be a father figure that emotionally overreacts all the time. And like it, it was your father or something. But like you, ever since you grew up, you, like you... You grow up with like, uh, you grow up very insecure or like criticizing yourself or something like that. Okay. The sun, give yourself permission to experience joy. Exactly. So you guys, I'm, I am getting someone infected. I'm not getting like, like sexual though. It's definitely giving, it can be transmitted sexually, but it's giving me more like, it, if it's family members, it's like. They will draw you in and be your friend and then say some condescending comment to get you all in your feelings it's like why would they say that it's like yeah something like yeah with the ten of cups reverse and the king of swords reverse it could be someone in your family they don't want you to move forward it's like they're a really mean person and if this is a lover it i mean it can be like a sexually transmitted demon um and like you're insecure someone's insecure about something even if you're away from this person it's like they're their poison is still in you okay we have the nine of coins though so you're independent nine of wands reverse someone has been trying to curse you definitely no lie about that someone has been trying to like curse your life or 
curse you so that you can't make certain decisions or that such you would be afraid to leave your home or something like that they want you to overthink your every move we have the chariot here yeah so something about overcoming adversity overcoming your challenges still move forward and overcome your challenges here someone doesn't want you to like travel four of wands reverse Queen of Swords of Earth. Could be a female. Give me another one. Seven of Cups. Someone is confused out here. Someone doesn't... Someone might... I don't... I think I'm picking up on somebody that doesn't know their worth. But they don't know their worth because they have... It's It's because they're infected. They got something on them. They got something on them. They can't like study. You could be going to school or someone's going to school. They can't keep their mind on their studies or something. Let's see what else. Eight of Wands. We have the Nine of Cups with the High Priestess. Someone has like a secret um, sexual life. <laughs> okay, is also what I'm picking up. Yeah, it could be a female here. Virgo energy. Okay. I don't know what that's about. You know a secret about somebody. You know a, se a secret about this snake. You could be a Pisces. And Ten of Wands reverse. Eight of Cups reverse. I don't know. I feel like a lot of this is projection though because of that moon here. But yeah, we have the Eight of Coins here with the Hangman reverse. Yeah, so I don't know. Somebody's weird because they feel like they they feel like they could blackmail you or they have they hold something over your head or something or that they, they can hold something over your head. No, it's really it's literally just you. It's you holding something over your own head because you may be a great person. That's what this is about. Know your worth. Yeah, someone is stuck. You could be enlightened but still stuck. Because I feel like you, there's something here. There's some, you need to detox something out of you. You need to get something out of you. I don't, however you, however you know how to do it. Get it out of you. Because it's not it's not you it's on you or something like that okay ten of swords reverse and nine of wands reverse and the emperor this could also be a masculine here yeah i've been picking up like divine masculine energy lately taking control not letting no one trick them or get in their head what's the four of wands reverse Someone, someone is holding on to a marriage, okay? It's not doing anything. They're like desperately holding on to a relationship. What's the four of wands reverse with the four of coins? Six of wands. They're desperately holding on to a relationship for the, for the attention or for the success. I don't know what that's about. What, what's the queen of swords reverse? I'm also getting someone that is going to uh, give out information to lure you in. I don't know what that's about. Yeah, the Empress. This Queen of Swords reverse is after this Empress. She's after this Empress. This Emperor here is just getting out of this mindset like he can't know his worth. Because he could have like, the dysfunctional family members or something. I don't know. What's the Seven of Cups? <laughs> the Sun. The Hermit and the Death in the Reverse. The Hermit and the Death in the Reverse. You could like be still um, gaining joy and happiness. You could still be a very happy person. And someone is in awe and confused as to where you're getting your happiness from. 
because they know that you're not getting it from them. So I don't know what that's about. I've been getting a lot of weird downloads lately, so just bear with me. It's like they're all rushing in because I've been so busy. What's the uh, Nine of Cups? Four of Cups. Four of Cups with the Nine of Cups. The Queen of Coins. And Temperance. I feel like this is Divine Feminine. This is the Empress here. Something about hope, keeping composure keeping composure in tough times and situations and stuff like that i feel like this feminine has like mastered that and look there's a snake around her there's a snake around her so it's given me like this person had to like use their gifts to conquer something or escape something what's the high priestess Ace of Wands, the Magician Reverse, and the Ace of Swords. Yeah, someone is like cutting out like whatever someone is trying to do to keep them stuck. This is all a plan to keep someone stuck. That's all I'm seeing here. That's all this reading is about. It's a plan to keep someone stuck. Eight of Cups Reverse. Okay, we have a tower, and there's a lot of projection going on, too, is what I'm getting for today's readings. I can't make it up. Knight of Swords Reverse. There's projection going on in these readings today, guys. A lot of them. Because someone can't walk away from the past, or they can't. It's like this shocking tower moment is happening, and no one can do anything to stop it. And they're running their mouth, and it's just like, okay, who cares? You could also be experiencing a tower, but you're holding more composure than this King of Swords reverse here. You probably work with this person. It's like, dude, chill, chill out. Someone is mad at you, they're slandering you, they're trying to blackmail you or something. Someone is mad because a masculine may wanna be with you or something, or I don't know if you're the masculine, or you could be this karmic projecting in this reading. Someone doesn't want someone to know their worth, take any leaps of faith. They want the venom to stay in them. They don't want it to get cleared out. What's the eight of coins? Six of cups reverse, and definitely something about childhood or something. Someone has worked hard since a child. Someone never gave you your credit. And this could also be a family member too. Family member, cousin, it could be an X too, but the type of venom that I'm getting for this reading is like the type of venom that a loved one can only do. It's like uh, someone you looked up to as a child or something like that, okay? Yeah, the star reverse. It's like a dream, someone's a dream crusher out here. They don't let you just work and mind your business. Yeah, Queen of Wands reverse, Strength reverse. It's like someone can't get you to do what they want you to do. You may work with somebody too and they, they're like jealous of you and they, they have low self-esteem around you. They're real insecure around you and they just won't let you do your job. They won't let you like just do you. <laughs> I don't know. These readings are just all over the place lately. I'm hearing take time to heal. Someone snaps at you. It's like they, they snap at you a lot or something. Page of Wands reverse. Three of Cups reverse. Yeah, they snap at you or something. You can't trust this person. Yeah, the Queen of Swords. Yeah, you feel like these... Uh, if these are friends too, uh, if you're a feminine and you got friends like this, um, these women are jealous of you. <laughs> and they're just mad at you because you're smart. Okay, yeah, the Knight of Pentacles, irresponsible. Whoa. Eight of Wands reverse. 
also you're not going you're not going back and forth with somebody there's block communication or they're trying to send out um I don't know. I, I feel like they want you to know that they're talking about you. And I feel like you don't care. <laughs> I don't know. These are like uh, toxic friends. Yeah. Queen of Wands are very strength averse. It could be a Leo. Aquarius. Someone is mad at you because they try to like end you or something because they're jealous of you. They even like um got a group together to take from you or something. Or they wanted a group to come together. I'm hearing I saw that. So you saw something. I don't know. I feel like there's a, a group of weak uh, females over here though. Yeah, and they don't like you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's see. The judgment reverse here, the nine of cups reverse. One more. And the nine of pentacles, period. So I feel like what's going on here is that people are just mad because you what you don't want to be bothered. Yeah, five of wands reverse. It was hidden behind the strength reverse. These people like to hide behind competition, or they like they like to use competition. Or these are people that claim that they're fighters. They're not really fighting nobody. They will never fight nobody or lay a finger on nobody. Like someone is. Someone runs their mouth too much. What's the Three of Cups of Earth? Someone may know this. King of Swords. Yeah, someone's smart. Or you're smart. You're schooling people out here. Five of Swords of Earth. Yeah, you're smart. Eight of Wands of Earth. Power. What? I don't understand how these people did not expect this. Yep, Libra. It has everything to do with justice. Four of Wands. Stability. Your relationships, contracts. Something is your right is also what I'm getting. It's like your rights. What's the Queen of Wands reverse? Someone could be like reading someone their rights. Ace of Wands with a death card. What's the Ten of Swords reverse? Okay, so someone is like able to dig theirself out of a hole. That's good. But I'm also getting there's a Queen of Wands reverse here. She's mad because like things are transforming and she's not able to keep up with the transformation. Someone is only attracted to someone for uh, sexual reasons and that's it. And that's why the relationship didn't work out. I don't know. That's also what I'm getting. But what's the death with the Ace of Wands? The Queen of Wands reverse. Yeah, the King of Pentacles here. I feel like this feminine wanted this masculine for um, immature reasons, okay? They wanted this masculine around for immature reasons. Someone wanted karmic connections to stay together. They're like trying to make karmic connections stay together. What's the five of wands reverse? So everyone's competing over some masculine and where his attention is going. Yeah, whoever, wherever this masculine wants to go, that's where he wants to be. <laughs> wherever this masculine wants to go, that's where he wants to be. Yeah, Ace of Swords, I'm not lying. Some people believe that wherever the masculine goes, you know, it's never going to change where his heart is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That can be true sometimes too, but that's not what's going on here. A masculine's going to be where he wants to be. Period. And, th and then we have the Ace of, Ace of Cups with the King of Wands here. People are fighting over this masculine here. And this masculine's like, why? Like, it's, it's never that serious. It's like, these people are doing the most. And someone can see how low vibrational a group of people are. And how smart you are. And yeah. What's the Ace of Swords? Yeah, the Two of Cups. Someone relates to you. That's all. Yep. The Hierophant doing the right thing. This could be a contract. I'm also hearing a new baby or something for some of you guys with the Ace of Cups. 
What's the judgment reverse? Someone is, oh, someone, yeah, page of swords reverse, throw an evil eye. Throw an evil eye because they're trying to escape judgment. Not resting. Someone chases the bag instead of let the bag come to them, you know. Yeah, four of pentacles reverse with the queen of cups. The lovers reverse. Ooh, I'm also getting like some sort of competition when it comes to like, it's like an emotional test or something. You're being put through it and someone else is being put through it out here and someone knows who to pick. I don't know. And when it comes to a relationship, maybe. Or it's like um, something about keeping your composure lately. Yeah, strength. It's something about keeping your composure, just being able to stay consistent and focused. Yeah. What's the Nine of Cups reverse? Hangman. So you may also live a very unconventional life. You just do things differently. So what? You're the Knight of Wands son. It's like someone needs to leave you alone or like your son could be like very, um, you know, they're Knight of Wands son. They're not gonna sit still, okay? So like you can't force him to sit still. He's happy, okay? It's like something like that could be happening here, but if this is a person, it's like, or if this is you, I feel like this could be you. It's like, someone maybe try to demonize you for being the Knight of Wands energy, and it's, it's not that, you just, it's like you go after what you want. Oh, what's the Nine of Pentacles and you get inspired? Strength is here. It's like, at least you have any light in you at all. Yeah, the Queen of Cups. Yeah, the Six of Cups out here with the Seven of Cups and the Four of Cups reversed in Temperance. The weird thing about this is someone doesn't know like why they don't like you. That's what I'm getting for this whole like situation. It's like they keep you close, they draw you in, they make you feel bad, they um, claim, oh, we're family, 22, 22 on the clock. And then they pull you in just so that they can keep, get you close enough so that they can bite you or say something, say something stupid. Any messages for this reading? You don't have to put up with this. You can pretty much do whatever you want. <laughs> I feel like someone is playing in your guys' energy. Any messages? I'm gonna stop shuffling in a minute. Okay, I'll take this. All right, so we got December. Rumors have been cleared up or will. Pay attention to your dreams. You're seeing the right things. They're just a troll. Be careful with the food you're eating. Don't forget they don't want us healthy. Paranoia, sleepless nights, feeling like people are out to get you. Um, generational wealth. Tables have turned walking a mile in your shoes. Someone has been trying to um, a destiny swap. Yeah, because they see that you're in a power couple dynamic. They're a troll. The, the rumors have already been cleared up or someone's like very low vibrational or something and, and like they're stuck on past events <clears throat> they just keep trolling the situation or their energy keeps coming up because they're a troll they still feel like they have like some sort of control over you and what you do with your life and they don't stay ready so you don't have to be, get ready I feel like this is you yeah, something about school or something. Yeah, I definitely tapped into someone that cannot tap into their studies because someone is distracting them. They're doing it on purpose. It says, did you forget you're an heir or an heiress to a throne that was hidden from you? Exactly. So I'm also getting like, if this is family members, they know that something's supposed to be given to you and this is why they treat you this way. You could be going to school, doing a lot for yourself. They don't support you or... They rather um, troll you or, you know, 
make you feel low about yourself or something yeah watch how you're speaking to yourself whatever you're saying you're right prayers too something about anger don't let someone trigger your anger yeah the virtuous woman someone is trying to anger a virtuous woman they're trying to make her mad okay Someone is mad that this um, Aries is a virtuous woman or a leader. <clears throat> if you didn't get something you really wanted at this time, if you feel stuck or feel like things are not going according to your plans, know that something bigger and better is coming. It's something filled with divine magic that couldn't come into your life if you were to receive what you are asking for now. Yeah, so this is one of those situations where, like, if you didn't get something good, it's a good thing you didn't get it. Or, like, you need to know your worth, okay? In your journey, there will be times when you feel lost, confused, lonely, and angry. These are times of transition. You won't feel those emotions forever. You are, in tr you are transitioning to a better, stronger version of yourself. Shed away those unneeded layers and keep growing. Yep. Someone wants like some sort of poison to stay stuck to you. So just be careful. That's all I'm saying. If you frequently give yourself permission to doodle, wander, and be totally unproductive, and you actually relish such interludes, I can guarantee that your genius, creativity, and productivity will increase exponentially. So yeah, I'm also getting someone that maybe tried to suppress you as a child. Um, they can't act like they didn't do that. They know what they did. I'm getting like someone here... Um, who didn't let you like draw they didn't let you read anything that brought you joy they would take it from you pretty much even if it required you learning and drawing and getting into music or something like that they didn't care about your dreams and your goals and i feel like that's sad it's like that matilda energy and someone can't act like they didn't treat you this way someone has definitely treated you this way or they or you know they treated somebody this way and you're not buying whatever the heck they're trying to whatever they're trying to put out into the community you're not buying it okay you know how someone is i don't know and then i'm picking up friends out here or toxic friends out here who are just mad <laughs> and they're gaslighting you trying to pull you in and every time they pu you pull you in they say something they say something weird to you. A lot of you guys just need to cut everybody off. Cut the grass. Cut the grass. Cut everybody off. All right, so this is your guys' reading. Hope this resonates for you. If it does, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye.